Heartbreaking graffiti uncovered in a Cambridgeshire church has revealed how three sisters from one family died in a plague outbreak in 1515. The names Caterin, Jane, and Amy Mattingly and the date were inscribed on stonework in Kingston Parish Church. It was found by Norfolk and Suffolk Medieval Graffiti Survey volunteers. Archaeologist Matt Champion said the project had shown church plague graffiti was far more common than previously realized. The most heartbreaking inscriptions are those that refer to long-dead children, he said. The Mattingly graffiti is hidden under lime wash near the door in All Saints and St. Andrew's Church. The family lived in Kingston, seven miles from Cambridge, and were tenant farmers who rarely turn up in parish records, he said. Mr. Champion believes Caterin, Jane, and Amy must have been children because their names are not found as adults in any of the records. In 1515, there was an outbreak of bubonic plague in London which spread across southeast England. Mr. Champion said Cambridge University suspended its classes and large gatherings of people were banned, just as we see today with the Ebola outbreaks in Africa. Children were particularly hard hit and usually hastily buried in unmarked graves. The graffiti survey was set up in 2010 and is the first attempt to survey pre-Reformation graffiti in churches since the late 1960s. Volunteers use digital cameras and powerful lamps to reveal previously hidden or faded markings. At least 60% of the 650 churches surveyed in Norfolk, Suffolk and North Essex have significant amounts of graffiti and volunteers have recorded up to 500 pieces in many of them. The project has confirmed more graffiti is found to have been created during times of pestilence such as the Black Death of 1349 and subsequent outbreaks of plagues. It was a votive offering at a time where prayer counted, Mr. Champion said.